I'm Mike from Toe on the Trigger, and when I'm having kidney problems, I like to have a camera shoved up my dick hole. Can you leave a urine specimen to start with? Uh, I can try. So you're having a procedure today called cystoscopy, where Dr. Jones looks inside your bladder to make sure everything inside is looking normal. Yeah. Right? Have you had something like this done before? No. All right. Have you had a catheter? No. Okay. Um, let me go grab a pen. Basically, um, there'll be some lubricant involved called glido, so it'll numb everything up, okay? Yeah. Catheter, do you know how it works? Kind of. Okay. So, interested that you're right there and your bladder drains, but except this is a camera, that's why it's called a stethoscopy. This part in goes through the urethra, and we look inside the bladder. As long as everything looks normal, it should be a quick procedure. How uncomfortable is it? Um, or <laughs> painful? <laughs> I'll right, probably say more uncomfortable okay. than pain. But that's why we use the glider so everything goes smoother for you. Right. Okay. Um, so that's basically it. The most discomfort for men I've noticed is when they, um, when Dr. Jones passes through the prostate. Like it's uh, a little okay. bit tighter. Yeah. In your right throat. Yeah. Okay. Through. Yeah. But he's very good about warning before getting to that area. Yeah. All right. So, um, okay. So I do need you to get undressed completely from the waist down. Okay. Uh, Oh, this may cause some burning. Go yeah. So that's normal. Oh, tight. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh. Try to put it in as much as I can. Clamp around. I'll so help the jelly stay in, okay? Alright. Oh, my fucking God, though. No. Is that going to fit in there? Yeah, it'll fit. Oh, yeah. Just go slow or something. Actually, you've got a fossa navicular stricture. I don't know what that means. Well, you got a tight area. Are we to expect any tearing or anything like that? No, it shouldn't be any tearing at all. That's why I'm stopping. Should be a, this, this, if, if, if I can't advance the scope easily, I'll, I'm not going to. Okay. But yeah, the, you, you, yeah. So you're either congenitally tight or you have an acquired tightness. And yet, it doesn't. Let's do anything. Are you yeah. kidding me? It seems like I'm abnormally... Is that abnormally yeah. tight? Yeah, it's not, it's not... It's not way tight, but it's pretty tight.
Alright, try them. Go. Yep. It ain't happening. It's not worth it. We're done. Sorry, buddy. We talk about it when you get dressed. So, whatever you, that was not a normal cystoscopy. That was just basically an attempt at dilation of your of your distal urethral stricture. Distal urethral. So the procedure was a no go, and uh, as the doctor had speculated when he came in and observed my flaccid, uncircumcised member. He thought that my urethral opening was too small to continue, but he didn't decide to stop until he tried inserting four uh, different size uh, rubber dilating rods into the end of my cock. Uh, one which was the size of a number two pencil and after about the fifth or sixth attempt he decided that it might be better not to go through with the procedure uh, he did stick what looked like a knitting needle in there and wiggled it around some but uh, that wasn't working out <laughs> I did get my wiener touched by a pretty hot Latin nurse that was kind of cool, but other than that, the experience was horrifying, and I don't want to do it again. So it looks like we're going to have to reschedule to do an outpatient surgery where they will either cut or manually dilate with uh, anesthetics in order to get the camera, which you guys will see on the video, to get that camera down in there, uh, if I so choose.